Antonio, the, the theme, the idea of Antonio uh, Morales. Mark had the same idea as Uri and we had, and he actually suggested the name uh, Dominoes, the Domino Cycle, or Domino Theme. Of course, it's cyclical, so it's Domino Cycle. And moreover, this problem showed uh, I mean, a cycle of uh, four pairs of variations. So let's let's follow this problem. It's a bit more uh, complex. This is the key. And the thread is rook to f4 because the p. Okay, now let's go for the defenses. So, first pair of defenses is simply capture of the rook. What happens here is that the rook unguarded this, this part here. And this is what we uh, can turn uh, This is a, an unguard, the main is this one. But it's special that under because it's a focal plane. If we go back, you can see that this rook guards this square, preventing this thing, but also guards this square, preventing the mate on knight f6. So it's a focal underdrive. Next variation. Same defensive effect. And now line opening and the queen mate on d3. And we move to the next, so this is first pair. First pair we capture here. <coughs> Second pair, the defensive effect is check. So we have check on d5. And again, the same uh, weakening effect, line opening. And next, check on d3. And now this allows activation of the button. So this is the weakening effect. So this is second pair. Third pair, bishop to d4. And this is, we are cutting the line of this bishop. So um, under <coughs> d3. And this is the main. Again, we activate the button. Now c5, the same defensive effect, cutting the, the, the guard of the And now it's an unguard, simple unguard. C, c7 left the guard of this, of this. And now the final pair, group f2. And this is uh, direct guard. And it's again an unguard of d3. And now we have to close the cycle. And we close it by this move, rock to g4. Again, it's a direct guard, just like the direct guard by the previous variation, previous defense. And now we use, again, the focal unguard of f6. So this is the floor. Variation. And now let's see how uh, <coughs> how this looks on the domino cards. So you can see that we can arrange the eight variations, the four pairs of variations, like this. So we have uh, the defensive uh, effects on the left side. And the weakening effects, and the way uh, which allows white to be made on the right side, on the white side. So you can see how uh, this is arranged and how uh, it is cyclical. And graphically, this is the first pair, these two. Second pair, 
third pair, and now fourth pair, and you can see how these two are reconnected. When, so the fourth pair connects with the first pair, closing the side. So this is cyclical domino. Of course, if there's cyclical domino, we do non cyclical domino or linear domino. Um, we never can choose the domino we like. 